Hello, everyone. This is Garrett Stewart with Command Consult and your referral partner for Reno Sparks in Northern Nevada, hopefully. Uh, wanted to give you a quick little update. You may have seen a notification just pop through. Uh, I'm filming this of May 7th. So uh, if you happen to see this pop through, you may have seen this new email composer. Uh, and you're like, what the heck does that mean in your notifications? Well, uh, it's a really cool way where instead of in the past, where we would send one-off email smart plans, now we have a way to kind of just type out a one, um, one-off email out to one client or a few clients or anything like that, or contacts in our database. So in the past, you would just click on your email, and that would kind of copy the email address, and you could save it, or, and, or copy it, and then you paste it in your own email, like your Gmail or wherever. Well, now you can actually click on that, and you have the choice of command email or desktop. So desktop can open up like your email provider and things and doing it that way but maybe you want to keep this all in-house and ready to go so we'll click on that and now you can see you've got uh it's going to come from your uh kw command email address there uh, so make sure you have that set up so it shows your name when it's as the sender and then of course just like you would type in a subject i'll just put <laughs> this is a test um we'll put that in and now we can go through and write an entire email out to people. Now, a couple things to note here. This isn't meant for uh, for design emails. So if you're creating a HTML type template in, in designs and hoping to import that, it doesn't function that way. That would be through campaigns and things like that. This would be a way to be able to just type out a little one-off email, maybe include some hyperlinks. Uh, you can add attachments on this, which is really cool too. So, I mean, heck, you could even send an offer uh, in as well. So, uh, works really well. So, hello. Uh, and then, yeah, just type in everything. So, I could just say, if it's, hello, Garrett. How are you? Type in what it what you want and the really cool part is um they added this email signature portion um and so now we can add signature and i already created a test one here called business but let's just go ahead and manage signature and you can see i did a test one there let's add another one so we could just type call this one um test and from there you could just type in again your name and you can do it however you want. If you want to kind of make it a little bit fancy, maybe like have your, um, I've seen somewhere they have like the first name, like all bold and fancy looking and then the rest um, re regular. You could do that. So you could be realtor. Your license number, all that good stuff in there. Uh, and kind of continuing on any other contact information. Uh, another good thing you can do is, I mean, you can even, put in your uh, website uh, address. So if I had, um, you know, something like that, Garrett sells Reno.com uh, and do that, you could even create hyperlinks or you could even do it this way of click here for a, or for a free home value. You could do something like that, click and select here. And uh, this is a hyperlink button where if they select here, you could, go to where your home value site is. If you use the new KW agent websites, create a home value page on there and copy and paste that link on there. That will give a blue uh, underline on there. And then that way it's just ready to go. So for this example, we'll just copy this website address um, just so you can see how it works. We'll paste it in there. We'll hit add link. And as you can see, it's blue, it's ready to go. So wherever your website address is that you want to hyperlink and kind of make it blue, you can do that, which is really cool. Um, this makes it, which it was really nice, and you can kind of see all your different ones there. But what's really cool is if people click on that, um, that will show up as a click in your reports applet. I love the email reporting in, the, um, in this applet, and you can see if people are clicking on your links. Um, so, and who clicked on your link? So once you did that, did that you can you know select that go get out of there and then um, since we're done um, managing that we can get done with that but maybe you want to add an attachment uh, so let's just go through here and just say uh, typed up an offer the other day I added in this offer on here perfect uh, I want to send it to a client or something like that just to review the offer you can do it all within here which is really cool uh, and then finally to add in that email signature that you did that's just right there. And yeah, here's the test one I created. It drops it in right there. Looks great. 
uh, and ready to go. And then all I need to do from there is hit send. And before I do that, you can see all the other options. I mean, I can do center text, right alignment. Um, this is, uh, you got a, a different emojis there, bold, italicize. Uh, you can even change the font color, um, any bullet points, things like that. Uh, and remember the hyperlink thing you can do here as well. So you can even hyperlink to different properties. Check out a few links to these properties and just have it right from there. Uh, and the cool thing is this is gonna all log into through command. So once I hit send, and now I'll hit um, the one thing to know, <laughs> Uh, it won't live update right there. If I hit that refresh button now, and you'll see the email that was sent right here. One thing I did notice is it does not um, show uh, the actual email content. Uh, hope, I'm hoping at some point we'll get uh, a way to be able to see that, at least at this point. Uh, to my knowledge, I don't see a way to actually um, see the content that you sent. So um, make sure that subject line, you'll be able to know what was sent um, on that type of stuff. But uh, uh, that's it at that point. Uh, one other little thing to uh, know about is we'll go to the fake leads. And uh, under that fake leads here, uh, we'll be able to see... Uh, uh, let's just say you could select these, you can hit that, and now you can actually uh, send it as an email. So you can send an email to those people that way too, which is really cool. Uh, I don't see a merge tag option on here currently, um, so just heads up there. Uh, it's going to show up um, as that name, or you can't say, you know, personalized to each individual name. So one little nuance there as well. Um, and this is getting better every single uh, day. So, uh, and there's, I'm not sure where that garbage can do, but does either. Uh, learning this as we go, but uh, exciting update just to do a little one off email. If you want to see more of my command training videos and support, you can go to my website, commandconsult.com, click on that video tab uh, and see some of my video trainings there. As always, I'd love to be your referral partner for Northern Nevada, Reno, Sparks, Carson City, uh, and all the areas. So feel free to reach out to me at any time. Uh, my email was right there, garrettstewart at kw.com. Thanks so much for reaching out and have a good day.